Senator Jeff Flake has criticized the president before on a number of issues, and he recently published a book slamming Trump and his supporters. But this morning, Trump fired back, giving Flake's opponent a very big shout out right here on social media. Political editor Dennis Welch has more tonight. Excuse me. With one tweet, Donald Trump upended Arizona's Senate race, giving the underdog Republican challenger a big boost and slamming the incumbent, Jeff Flake. The president tweeting this morning, great to see that Dr. Kelly Ward is running against Flake, Jeff Flake. He's toxic. I was shocked. Republican consultant Stan Barnes. Donald Trump has given life to a campaign that, in my opinion, wasn't going to be successful. Ward has struggled to raise money and has come under fire for making insensitive comments about Senator John McCain's brain cancer diagnosis, as well as sending out gratuitous campaign mailers to voters. Given the way Donald Trump comports himself in office, I, I, I can't imagine he is in any way off-put or offended by anything Kelly Ward has, has said. And given her history, Barnes also wonders if the president's tacit endorsement of Ward will end up costing him his ultimate goal of defeating Flake next year. From a, a neutral political view, there are other candidates that were better suited to, to run a real race with Jeff Flake. And we did reach out to Ward for comment about this, but she was unavailable today. All right, Dennis, we've seen reports that Trump was considering other candidates. We've talked off air. Is this unprecedented? Did this just tweet come out of nowhere? It really, I, I talked to a lot of people today, it, it kind of in that Trump orbit here in Arizona. This really took a lot of people off guard. It came really out of nowhere. A lot of talk about some other candidates out there that Trump might get behind. Someone like a Jeff Flake, who's been a loyal supporter for a long time. Someone like Robert Graham, former chairman of the uh, Arizona Republican Party, who helped uh, deliver Arizona to Trump last year. People thought that those were the two guys that was kind of vying for all of this. This, treat, this tweet comes out, it changes really everything. I mean, uh, you know, the president could come out later and give a full throat an endorsement to somebody else, but by and large from now until this primary is over next year, Ward can look at this tweet and put this tweet out there as, as, as an endorsement from the president. I mean, it is a game changer. How is it being received by other Republicans? This is the same party <laughs> fight right, right here. Well, I can tell you, at least here, you know, Senator uh, John McCain, and even like someone like a Bob Corker from Tennessee is coming out and saying, Look, Jeff Flake is a good guy. Arizona's lucky to have him. They're kind of coming to his defense uh, because, you know, you look at Kelly Ward, you look at her history. Um, she's been, you know, con connected. She's had public hearings uh, as a state senator on chemtrails. Uh, you know, this was something that the McCain people really slammed her for um, last year, and she was beaten pretty badly by McCain uh, during, that, during that campaign. It is going to be interesting. Dennis Wells, our political editor, thank you.